Hey everyone, it's Heather and my husband Philip. Um, we are post ultimate reset now. We finally finished the 21 day Beach Body Ultimate Reset Detox. And we wanted to give our results. And I wanted to just first and foremost tell everybody that this is hard. It is a challenge. You really have to be dedicated. Um, you need a support group. You need to have supportive people that are going to help you with it. This is not for everybody. Um, I mean, you really, really, really have to dedicate yourself to this. Uh, you know, I really loved the food. I think you like the food. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was it was good. Um, some of the recipes I didn't like, but I figured, you know, that's, that's how it's going to be. You're not going to love everything. I will tell you, I am a little bit done with fruits and vegetables for a while. There is a lot of fruits and vegetables, but it's, it's really good. And the most challenging for me was the third week because as each week progresses, you are slowly eliminating things out of your diet. And the third week I found myself the most crabby. Um, and that's why I didn't blog or do any other videos. You know, I apologize that I haven't done that. I've had a few people ask me what's going on and it's really because it just got repetitive and it was just, it was just difficult. Um, but anyways, overall, you know, the whole reset, I felt good. The only thing that wasn't for me was just that I was hungry and I did get a little crabby. Um, but energy wise, I felt great. I did, you know, light walking and I did do a little bit of lifting, doing Les Mills pump, but it was very, very, very lightweight. Sorry, you can hear our son uh, talking up a storm over there. Um, but for me, I lost seven pounds, which I was not expecting to lose any weight during the reset, but I did. So I lost seven pounds. Um, and the reason why I did the reset was to change my eating habits. Do I think it helped change my eating habits? Yes and no. Um, yes, now when I give my kids the junk that they eat, you know, because I do give them like, animal cookies or goldfish for a snack or something, I'm not inclined to take a handful and eat it myself. But do I still crave treats? Yes, of course, you know, I still would love to have some ice cream. Hi! Um, and, you know, I, I'd love to go out to dinner. Yes! And, you know, we still want to go out to dinner and enjoy a good, a good meal um, at a restaurant. But for the most part, you know, I just wanted to prevent myself from snacking all the time. And I'm still sticking, or I'm going to be sticking to eating not as often. Like I was eating nonstop in the afternoon. That's something that was not good for me, is just constantly eating the carbs and all that junk. So now I'm trying to wait at least two hours and snack on fruits and vegetables and nuts. So for me, yes, I do think my overall goal was achieved. So I'm... I'm pretty happy. Now, would I do this again? No. I don't think I will ever do the ultimate reset again. Um, I don't know. I just, it was extremely hard. That's the only reason why I wouldn't do it. I love food and, you know, I want to, I want to eat. So I didn't like not being able to eat as often. So, so that's it. So, <laughs> so, um, I lost a total of 20 pounds in 21 days. Um, my blood pressure went from around 145 over 85. It's down around 116 over 75 now. So my blood pressure did go down. Um, today was the first day back to working out. And I would say it was a little bit of a struggle working out today. But um, I felt pretty good. And I think uh, weeks to come I'm going to feel even better. I do have a lot more energy than what I used to have as well. Uh, but overall... Um, I've also posted um, my results on Heather's team page, and everyone can see a big difference between what I looked like before and, and after. So um, a lot of the weight I lost was actually more fat than anything. I didn't lose any muscle. Uh, my arms and my chest and everything still measure the same. It's mainly my waist, and I'm actually fitting into size 32. I have not wore a size 32 in four years. Uh, I've been wearing 36s and 34s. So it's kind of nice to be back into a 32 and and uh, they actually fit. Mommy broke. Is that it? That's it. Okay. <laughs> um, so, and everybody's results are going to be different. My before pictures were really, really dark, so I really couldn't see too much of a difference. But yes, um, some of my pants were, I didn't even have to unbutton to get them on and off. I can just slide them off. So I did lose inches as well. But, you know, overall, I think it was good for us to do this, you know, one time. I don't think, again, we're going to do it again. Um, 
but you know, if you're interested in getting the ultimate reset, click the links below. Um, you can see what my journey was like on my blog, heatherfoltz.com. There's lots of great information on there about the reset and any other thing, you know, about diet and nutrition and stuff. So check it out. And if you want to connect with me, facebook.com slash heather.foltz. Let me know if you want to do the reset. You can join on in with my support group. So that way you've got some other people that are going to be doing it with you to have um, people to, you know, vent to or talk about the recipes to. Because it's really, really important because you are going to go you know, roller coaster. You'll have good days, you'll have bad days, but that's what we're here for. And overall, you know, you're wanting to change your internal health. So I think if you've got, you know, bad eating habits, I think this would be great for you. If you're wanting to lose a little bit of weight, great, blood pressure, cholesterol, anything that you need, I think this would be great for you. So connect with me, let me know. I want to hear from you and we will talk to you later. Bye. Bye.